James, first of all, welcome to Leicestershire. Can you just shed a bit of light of, of how you were made uh, aware of the situation? Um, well, I was um, obviously spent all the time in lockdown as everyone else did, and then um, come back to Durham where I was in the last year of my contract and being informed that I wasn't going to get an extension in that, so I was given the opportunity to go and um, try my cricket anywhere else I could really, and um, then managed to um, over time get an offer from Leicester to come down here and then hopefully try and play a bit of cricket down here. Yeah, it seems like it's been a bit of a whirlwind the past couple of weeks for yourself, as you say, being, being released by Durham, um, having your first baby, uh, and then obviously coming down to Leicestershire to, to meet with your, t- with your new teammates. Just uh, just shed a bit of light on, on how that's been for you. Um, yeah, it's been different, but it's been um, very fun at the same time. Um, obviously, having a baby was fantastic, and um, managed to spend a week at home with him. Um, and then had to come down here and get things started and then being able to um, go back when I get a couple of days off is always nice to go back and spend some time with the family and help the missus do some nappies and things and a few jobs around the house but that's about it yeah it's been very good yeah You've had a few sessions down here now at the Fisher County Ground with your new teammates how how do you feel you settled in ahead of the weekend's fixture? Um, Yeah very good Um, all the lads have been very welcoming the coaches um, especially Nico has been on the phone to me most days Checking my house is all right and checking everything's going well and I'm happy with the, uh, being away from the family and things. So, yeah, everything's been very good from their side of things. I'm sure it'll be a very strange situation for you come Saturday when, when you have the potential of facing the, the squad. You was only training with only a, a few weeks ago for, for your new team. How, how weird would that feel, bowling ball, at your the former teammates? Um, yeah, um, you've got to start somewhere, I suppose, but it's, a, it's probably a, um, puts a bit more pressure on me knowing the people I'm going to be playing against and their weaknesses and strengths and things. But... Um, now there's no better time to make a debut than against a bunch of blokes that you already know and you're probably going to feel a little bit relaxed playing with um, people on the other team that you're mates with and things, so no, it's, it's going to be brilliant. You took the word straight out of my mouth, obviously you know um, a lot about um, the Durham squad, their, their strengths, their weaknesses, how will that help you um, settle in and get into your stride, but um, the, the Leicestershire squad as well? Um, yeah, it's obviously going to be um, a bonus for me, knowing everything about the players on the other team or most of them anyway that I've played with. Um, and then uh, hopefully I can help a few of the lesser lads with that as well. And It's just going to be a more relaxed atmosphere being playing. It's going to feel a lot like a friendly at times if I'm playing against people that I've played with for a number of years now. And um, no, It's just going to be probably a surreal feeling if I do play against uh, and the team that I've played every first-class game I've ever played for against now but um, no it's going to be it, it will be what it will be and of course it is a uh, it is a big fixture in, in a way the the north group with both teams coming in to the fixture off the back of of tough defeats um, Durham against Lancashire and obviously it was against Derbyshire how keen will both teams be to, to put that right yeah Durham are going to be under a lot of pressure and um, they've had two poor games really from all aspects um, starting the season and obviously Leicester had a brilliant win first game and then had a bit of a poor game um, last week here against Derby so it'd be desperate for both teams to get a win really so it could be quite a cagey game but I think um, could be pretty much the first couple of days will probably show how it's going to go I would have thought and it's going to be um, hard fought and I think there'll be a lot of pressure on both teams so it could be a bit of a strange game but someone's going to have to come out on top.